Hello Tubers and welcome to the Fist Alignment Workshop. Uh, today we're continuing our series of Living With. The item today is booties. Mm -hmm. Oh, booties, sorry, yeah. I'll tell me even that. The, these oh, are my out, RST uh, Tractec Evo 3 Sport. Um, as you can see, they're a bit shitty. Um, thought I'd get these because RST are renowned for good quality and good prices. Who's RST? Who makes them? I don't know what it stands for. Really shit trainers? <laughs> so they make boots? Well, yeah, it could be. Mm, anyway. Now, I really like these. Um, someone they're actually. extremely comfortable uh, as a boot. They're, they've got uh, plenty of protection, but not that you notice by just walking around in them. So they're really good. Um, I chose the white ones. They do come in black. They're still available. I think these are probably last year's ones now. Um, but, yeah, I think they look smart in the, the white and black. They've got a very uh, fetching red interior lined. That is good. Big logo on the front, obviously, but if you're wearing them under your trousers, you can't really see it anywhere. <laughs> He's got out. Uh, yeah. uh, one thing I will say about these boots is they're naff in the rain. They're made, I think, as in the title, for a track, and the hottest day... That they make your rain better, then? Yeah. Oh, that's good, then. Yeah. Uh, the hottest day of the year, because of all the perforations in the top there, now, they're good and breathable, and in the summer it's very nice them uh, uh, with the airflow coming through, but in the rain, uh, rain even, they're shocking. Shite. Yeah. Um, they do... Wait! Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> and back to the studio. Yes. Well, as that demonstration proved, that these boots are suited for the heat. Um, as I was saying, they're enough in the rain, they uh, but very nice in, in the hot uh, weather with the cool breeze whipping around your toes. Um, I've had these for uh, about 18 months now, and they are holding up well. I, um, I've cleaned them about once. Uh, when I first got them, I did apply a bit of waterproofing uh, uh, treatment to them, but... Uh, well, that worked with holes, didn't it? Yeah, it didn't do anything. Well, might as well have gone over with bloody super glue. Um, Massive. Yeah, and massive. Mm. So, they're, they're very flexible. Nice heel bit. They stink. <laughs> I'm a vegetarian. Oh, sorry. Yeah. So yes, I'd highly recommend these. Yeah, they they uh, come in a range of colours. I think they might even do like a blue or green one as well. To be honest, um, worth looking up online. For me and two, it, these are my everyday riders. About three hundred. What? How much? Three hundred days a year. Oh. I, I wear them. So uh, out of the year. So Bank definitely recommend. Um, yeah, value for money. You can pick them up now, about uh, 50 quid. Right. Oh. Anywhere between 100 and 150 quid. Um, for a set oh, of decent boots. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. yeah. No, well, no, I wouldn't pay that either. Yeah, no, that's why they squeak. Mm. Yeah. But um, yes, I'd like to recommend them. So um, stay tuned for more episodes of Living With. Uh, check out all our other videos. Uh, don't worry about calling the Fire Brigade. I think we've got it out now. And uh, see you again. Like, subscribe, find us on Facebook, and thanks for watching.